Good morning guys. Today I'm going to be filming a little what I eat in a day video. These are some of my favorite videos to watch, some of my favorite videos to film. I feel like I get so many snack ideas and recipe ideas from these types of videos. So I thought it had been a little bit too long and I'm going to film what I'm going to eat today. I always, always start the morning by filling up my water bottle. I feel like this helps me start the day by drinking water instead of coffee. So we have the much beloved Stanley Tumbler here. So starting the day with water, a true game changer. Also very simple. But now I wanted to show you guys what I've been having for breakfast because it is so good, so fast, so easy. That's another reason why I wanted to film this video because I am a new mom. I would say a mom of a 10 month old is still a new mom. And I really appreciate quick, delicious, easy meals and snacks. So that's pretty much gonna be what this video is gonna consist of. So if you like that type of thing, let's get into breakfast. Okay, so breakfast today is like a take on avocado toast, but it's even more delicious in my opinion. All you're going to need is uh, half of an avocado and these Trader Joe's hash browns that you can find in the frozen section. They look like this. I'm sure you guys have seen these. I tried these a while ago and I kept trying them. I kept just being like, what is the hype about? Because I just thought that they were kind of oily and not the best tasting but that's because I was like frying them in a pan with oil and a lot of you guys told me to try to air fry them and that is game changing. So I'm gonna pop this in my air fryer. Also, I need to mention that Marcus got me a new camera. It's a lot fancier than my old camera that I was using for like five years. And now I'm just worried that I'm not working it correctly. So hopefully this video looks okay. Hopefully it's in focus. My finger is freezing off, so let's put this in the air fryer. We actually do not have a microwave, so I use this thing to toast things, bake things, everything, and it even has an air fryer setting. So I put it on air fry, and then I usually do it for about uh, like 12 minutes, and I flip it halfway through. Okay, and while that cooks, I'm just gonna prep my avocado. So I'm just going to cut that. I'm also gonna have one of these little rice cakes that I've been making. It's just a plain rice cake with peanut butter and dark chocolate, and then you just put it in the fridge, and it is so good. I also put a little bit of flaky sea salt on this batch that I just made. And now I'm gonna add some salt onto it. Then I'm gonna add half of my avocado, some crushed red pepper flakes to add a little bit of spice, and then just some pepper. I'm gonna eat this. I must admit, these peaches taste weird. They're kind of like bitter, like, you know, an unripe persimmon has like, takes all the moisture out of your mouth. These peaches are giving unripe persimmon. I'm gonna go finish this, and I will see you next time I eat. <laughs> Okay, somehow James is still asleep, so I'm gonna go work out in our little home gym, and I'm having my pre-workout, which I always have before I work out. Just gives a little extra pep in your step. Also wanted to show you guys, because I just got my Thrive Market order in the mail, which if you don't know what Thrive Market is, basically it's an online membership-based marketplace, and their goal is to make healthy living easy and affordable for everybody. So I wanted to show you guys one of my favorite snacks that we always have in the house, chomps. We absolutely love chomps. We have the jalapeno flavor. Here's what they look like. I'm sure you guys have seen them before, but these are so perfect to just grab and go. They're such a great high quality, high protein snack, and I love that they only use the best high protein meats like beef, venison, turkey, and they're all grass fed and finished. And so we have the jalapeno flavor, which is my personal favorite. And like I showed you guys, this is like their normal size. Perfect for on the go. But I also got these. These are called chomplings and this is the original flavor. And look how cute these are. They're like half the size, even more perfect for in your purse or on the go. And then this is a flavor that I have not tried yet. This is the Italian style mini sticks. 
and these are also the chomplings, which are so cute. And a little bit more about Thrive Market is they have two different membership options. So they have one month options, which are $9.95 per month, and then they have their 12 month option, which is $5 a month, and that is billed at $59.95, and that's the one that we have. I also just love shopping on Thrive because I know that they're gonna have the best prices. It's gonna save me money. It's gonna be convenient and that is especially important now that I'm a mom is anything convenient I love so you guys can click the link in my description box to check out chomps on Thrive Market and you can get 40% off of your first order and you can also get a free gift up to $50 if you join Thrive Market today so I will have all that info links down below thank you again to Thrive Market for sponsoring today's video Okay, so truth be told, I have not worked out yet because right when I was walking outside to work out, James decided to wake up from his nap. So me and my mom and James are out for lunch right now. We're going to grab some coffee. Everyone is going to want to see Cece. So here's Cece. Hey, everybody. Hope you're having a great day. I'm <laughs> I cannot with the camera. I cannot be myself. I have never... <laughs> In my life, I've heard you say that. I never have. I think hey, I've everybody. Heard. Hope you're having a great day. <laughs> Who are you? I'm, not, I'm shook. I'm alien. shook. I'm shook. <laughs> Just try to be normal and say hi. Uh, hey, y'all. <laughs> Why'd your voice go down seven octaves? <laughs> hey, y'all. <laughs> hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. What's up? With a camera in my face. Just say it one more time. Literally get the camera out of my face. Hey, everybody. <laughs> Mom, show everybody your Stanley cup of the day. Oh, I love it. Green and purple. Mm -hmm. I love you. Wait, is yours green? No, um, no, blue. Yeah. I got everybody in my family addicted mm -hmm. to these things. Even Marcus. And that's shocking because Marcus does not drink water. So, the fact that he uses that thing every day, I swear he drinks more water than all of us. Mm. And we're going to Falcon Coffee Bar. They have like really good, a train is going by, but they have really great vegan food and they have amazing coffee. So, I'll see you inside. Hey y'all. Hey y'all, I'll make up for my, I don't even know who that was before. Alter ego, camera alter ego. Mm. So good. <laughs> okay, we are back in the car. I could not even talk in there. That was the quietest coffee shop. Not one conversation was being had in that whole place, and we had James, and I just felt like... And he was so good. He was so good, but, oh my gosh, it was so quiet in there. I couldn't even say, like, oh, this is what we got for our food, because it, like, you could hear a pin drop in there, so... Yeah, everybody was working on the computers. Everyone was working on the computers, like That's a normal coffee shop, but... But it was, like, more quiet than a normal coffee shop. Mm. But anyways, I got a um, iced vanilla latte. We got a vegan Cuban sandwich, which was very good. And then the Bottega sandwich, which is kind of just like a breakfast sandwich. And they were both very, very good. Um, but I don't know, what would you rate that lunch? Well, Cuban was, um, I'd say a six. And um, the Bottega was definitely a nine. We were right over by one of the best places in Nashville. It's called the Buttermilk Ranch, right? I always say the Buttermilk Pantry, but it's right, Mom? Buttermilk Ranch. Yes. And they have an incredible bakery, and they have a double-baked almond croissant that is possibly the best thing I've ever eaten. And so I'm going to run in really quick and get one because um, I could never pass up one of these croissants. So... If you come to Nashville, you have to get one of these. It is literally miraculous. She is the moment. She is the moment. And look at this. 
<laughs> Are you joking? Okay, people got mad at me on my Instagram story because I ate it like split in half. Um, because I just thought, how am I gonna bite this? It's huge. But they said that is never the way to eat an almond croissant. Also, my mom is in there getting more almond croissants for her friends right now. Um, here we go. Mm. Oh my gosh. Look at those layers. Croissants are one thing that I am scared to try because I just know. Oh, it's okay, James. It's okay. Croissants are one thing that I'm scared to try. Okay, baby. Croissants are one thing I'm scared to try because I just know how hard they are. I could never. Like I could, I just have to leave it to the professionals. Okay, James wants a bite. Okay, guys, it is a little bit later. As you can see, a lot has happened. I've changed my outfit. I've also put on a little bit of makeup because I was filming something for work. But now it is 7.30. I just put James down for bed and I'm gonna cook some dinner. So tonight we are gonna be making crispy chicken thighs. They are so good and so easy. It's my mom's recipe, of course, and I'm gonna show you guys how we make them because they are so, so delicious. And I used to have no clue what to do with chicken thighs. I just thought, I had no thoughts basically. This recipe is so good and I think you guys will love it. It's a beautiful Tennessee night. It's getting so warm here, which I love. Feels like summer. The dogs are chasing each other and hopefully they don't go in the river. That has kind of been the one bad thing about living on the river is that the dogs, they know we're on a river and they know that if they sneak away for two seconds, they can be in the river and free and we can't really catch them. I'm watching you. I'm watching you, camper. Yay! Yay! So we have our chicken thighs here. I'm just gonna be making four tonight because it's just for me and Marcus. And the first thing we need to do is make our little seasoning blend. So this is literally the part that takes the longest and it doesn't even take long at all. But you need two teaspoons of onion powder, two teaspoons of garlic powder, two teaspoons of salt, two teaspoons of Italian seasoning, one teaspoon of pepper, switching it up, and one teaspoon of paprika. Paprika, paprika. Here is what our little seasoning mix looks like. Kind of beautiful. And then you're just gonna mix this all together. This is what we're gonna be using to, of course, season the chicken thighs. So, stirring it up. Okay, now my mom says this is a very important part. We're gonna take the chicken with very clean hands. I already washed my hands. And we are going to pat it dry because she said if you skip this part, then it doesn't get as crispy as you want it to. So make sure there's like barely any moisture left. And now we have a baking sheet that has um, some foil and I sprayed olive oil spray on there. And I'm gonna put the chicken in there and coat very generously with our seasoning that we made. Make sure to really coat it. Don't be shy. Okay, so I'm gonna rub this in on the top and then flip it over and do the same thing to the other side. Now your chicken should look like this and we are popping this in the oven at 400 degrees for 35 minutes or until the tops are super, super crispy. I'm gonna make some tater tots. I am not gonna make those homemade. And then I'm just gonna make a super simple salad and dinner will be done. Literally the best, easiest dinner ever. Okay, here is dinner. So the crispy chicken thighs, the tater tots, and I made a super simple salad. I'm gonna take a bite on camera because it is a what I eat in a day. The chicken is so juicy. It's so good. Mm. 
Do you grow up eating these types of salads, like cucumber no. salads? No, no. I feel like it's something that my family always yeah. does. You guys always do a cucumber salad? Or just a salad? And we would grow up like just not having good salads, I'm gonna be honest. Salad, like, I never liked salad grams because it was like, oh, salad, because it wasn't made nice. Like, I always thought salad sucked. And then my world opened up when I found out, wait, for better or for worse, Olive Garden. I had the Olive Garden, you know, the, is it that you picked too, or is that some other thing? That's Panera. Oh yeah, that's Panera. We had a lot of Panera at Olive Garden growing up, dude. That was like the ritzy titsy. And you know isn't that I mean? funny that I grew up never eating there? Well, that's because you had the booty bougie mom cooking you Italiano every night. Yeah, my mom cooked every night. We had that Olive Garden Italiano, and that was like, ooh, ritzy titsy time. Every night, I have to have something sweet. So tonight we're having some Trader Joe's Ginger Snaps. Let me show you what the box looks like. Cause y'all need to try these. Triple Ginger Snaps. These are so good. They have little pieces of candy ginger inside of them. <laughs> and what? It sounded like you read it, but I think you just said it. <laughs> it says made with crystallized ginger, blah, blah, blah but they're so good, dipped in a little milk. And that's the last thing that I'm gonna be eating today. And I hope that you guys enjoy this video. Maybe you got a recipe idea. I'll also, again, have the Thrive Market Chomps link down below. Thank you again to Thrive for sponsoring today's video. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. It's kinda nice having you hold the camera, to be honest. Um, and we love you, and we will see you soon. Bye. Lovey. Mom, give Lovey some lovey. Okay. Oh, that's so special. How are you so lovey? Amber ate cow poop today. That's mm -hmm. what he ate today. Mm -hmm. He snuck into the neighbor's field and ate all the cow poop. Why would you do it? Show them the chomp, 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 stomp and stomp us. Well, he's got the stinking stomp us. Incredible.